Sean. Okay, are you done? <laughs> okay, so impressions. Impressions. Okay, so face on. What's your impression of Tarid Rubion from Bahrain cuisine? We ate the leaves as well. <laughs> Okay, Tristan? I've had better. <laughs> Very good. Yeah? It's so good. It's really tasty. <coughs> <coughs> <He's> coughing. <coughs> it tastes yummy in my mouth. Okay. So yum. Mm -hmm. I miss my mom. Like my tongue likes the taste, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like growing on to me now. It's mm. like taste buds, just like. So what would you like to say, like the most special ingredient in this? I think it would be definitely be the... Um, the leaves? Uh, I think it would definitely be the owl. Owl. Oh. The turtle as well. Mm -hmm. uh, you could really taste the turtle. Um, I guess if there were some stones in it maybe, like some some sand and stuff. I think that's really good. Mm -hmm. <coughs> but the stones were really soggy, really soggy. I think there was like a... I think there may have been some broccoli um, and some sweet potato, but I'm not really sure about that. But that was really pretty tasty. Mm -hmm. But the main ingredient we're forgetting is the uh, I think is the bread that that feels like rice. But I think it's there may be mayo in it also. There may be mayonnaise. Um, yeah, it's really good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love it. Thank you. Thank you for your honest review. Of the, and, and your very, very um, detailed analysis of the recipe and everything, you know, especially the mayonnaise, you know, we, mayonnaise is very cherished in the Bahraini cuisine. We think it's uh, the best ingredient for everything, you know. Yes, well, Bahrainis keep it up. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Ish haidama. Yeah. Thank you. Now they're playing football and they specifically asked me to take a video. I don't know how this adds much value to the documentation of my life since I'm not part of this game. Oh, I thought, I thought, okay. Okay, sorry. Oh, pictures. We'll speak to pictures, sorry. Hello, Mama. Um, so today was a really nice day, actually. It was full from the very get-go. So I woke up, I went to Planned Parenthood, I worked on some translation, and then we had a meeting. And we started talking about, you know, privilege and stuff like that. And we started talking about why we came to Planned Parenthood and stuff like that. And it was really nice to hear everyone talk. And there was this woman who came with us to the meeting. Her name was Melanie. And she talked about being a doula. And it really got me thinking about being a doula as well. So, I don't know. Maybe it's something that I should consider doing as well. But I don't know. I don't know yet. I don't know much about it. I don't know much about anything when it comes to birth or ch children or anything like that. And then I had to go because my Tharid was coming. My Tharid is here. It's beautiful. It's Tharid Rubion, or as I call it, Tharid Rubion. And uh, it's, uh, it's Tharid with shrimps and it's amazing. It's beautiful. It's it's absolutely amazing. It tastes so good. And I felt so comforted when I had it. I felt so good and so safe and so happy. Like, I didn't feel like I had to go back to Bahrain anymore. I'm just like, if I mention my dad, I'm just like, I'm never going back to Bahrain. Like, now that I have Farid, or as I call it, Farid, because everyone's correcting me. They're saying, call it Farid. Now I'm going to correct myself. But now that I have Farid here, I'm like, I don't need any reason to go back to Bahrain. It was for $30 and it was really good. And then at 7, 
there was the uh, gathering of the mosque and we went there and there was a lot of new people, a lot of non-Muslims and we got to talk a lot about, you know, the dangers and oppression and, you know, standing up for things and it was nice and yeah, baby Nina was there and I, I get so happy when I see baby Nina and I was talking to her in Bahraini and I was like, baby Nina, you, people don't understand what you say and people don't understand when I talk as well. So we were both in the same situation and she just wanted to have my phone and I was like, no. Um, and she was really cute. And then I went to, to, I was on the way to go to Faizan's house so that we can go to Cafe Bab al-Hara where my Uber driver was asking me about Shias and stuff like that. And he was so respectful, he was so kind and so respectful. And he didn't ask any questions to be uh, pro, you know, uh, pro God, pro God, to, like, you know, to incite anything, you know, he wasn't being that, oh, he was just being really genuinely curious and genuinely uh, nice to me, and I was really thankful for that, and we talked for a while, and then I went to Faizan's, and we went to Karba Bihara, where, and we were waiting in the line, and we were talking to these guys on, in the, in the, in the line, and yeah, well, I just want to say one thing. When we entered Kaaba Hara, Faisal did this like, like this to us, and I was like, ah. And I told the guys that I was excited to see Faisal, and that was the first time Tristan knew about me thinking Faisal is cute, and he made a big deal out of it. Oh my goodness, he made such a big deal. And then, yeah, we were talking to these two guys. They were both Shia. One was called George, and he was a convert. And one was uh, called Mahmoud, he was from Iraq, Najaf, and they were really nice. And then we got to our table, and we sat, we started talking about different things. And I told the guys that I had Farid in my, Farid in my house. And they came to, to, after we finished, they came here, they came to the residence. We were downstairs, they were in my room, because my room was a mess. And they had it, and as you can see, they, they really enjoyed it. And by the way, if anyone is not aware of Bahraini food, Tristan was obviously joking. Our food is nothing what he's described, he was joking. Um, if anyone is ever in the capacity to have Bahraini food, I encourage it. And yeah, um, Faisal's birthday is coming up, so that's a big deal. And tomorrow I'm meeting a new friend, and on the weekend I'm also meeting another friend. So yeah, it's a, it's a busy week for me, and but you guys don't know because I think I'm, this is my first upload in a while, so yeah, good, bye!